Hey everybody, it's Blue Ducky, and today in this doll comparison, we're going to be looking at all the different Lizzie hearts from Ever After High. We have a couple different um, versions of her now, five in total. Uh, I don't think I'm missing any, but if I am, I apologize and let me know. Uh, so we got Signature Lizzie Hearts, the uh, Spring Unsprung Lizzie Hearts, and the Book Party Lizzie Hearts, Way to Wonderland Lizzie Hearts, and the Tri Castle on Lizzie Hearts. First of all, I want to check out the hair up close on each one of them. Uh, these three have more of a fancy updo. There's the signature Lizzie Hearts with her heart bun, and then the rest of her hair is loose. It looks really cool. The Way to Wonderland Lizzie has that roll on the top, and then the rest is loose behind her collar there. I do like Lizzie's hair. Fancier hairstyles, they're always kind of interesting. And then the Tricastalon Lizzie has this really cool uh, twist that goes into a ponytail. And then for Spring Unsprung Lizzie and the Book Party Lizzie, her hair is just loose. Check it out. Um, for Spring Unsprung, they added a little bit of pink there, but uh, her hair is mostly loose. She does have a little, um, like a poof there. That's pretty cool. And then for book party Lizzie, she just has her hair loose and simple, but it still looks great. She still somehow gets that height on the, her hair. Is there like a, I don't know, but she has like the tallest hair all the time. I love it. She looks so gorgeous. I think my favorite hairdo of hers is the Tricastle on. I really, really like how they did that red twist. Next we'll check out the makeup here signature Lizzie with her heart over her one eye, which she always has that heart over her eye, which I really like. It ties all her different lines together. Is the same character in the red lipstick. Here's the way to Wonderland Lizzie. She has gold makeup and the red heart and red lipstick and purple eyebrows this time. Next up is the Tricastalon Lizzie red lips and pink eyeshadow with a little bit of gold there and the heart. The Spring Unsprung Lizzie has a dark tan kind of eyeshadow really dark red lips and a the her heart over her eye and then finally there's book party Lizzie who has more like a different color red um it's kind of like a plum color and she has the heart over her eye and then more of that gold eyeshadow so I have a question for you guys do you think the heart of her one eye is supposed to be makeup or do you think it's like a birthmark she has all the time? Um, yeah, because, you know, she always has it and it's always like exactly the same. So, if you guys know, let me know. And another question I had is for, um, okay, so Ever After High has lines, obviously, that I don't have Lizzie in it, like the sugar-coated and Dragon Games. So far we haven't had a Lizzie and Legacy Day. So which one of the, like which line that doesn't have a Lizzie in it would you like to see them make a Lizzie doll for? I was thinking about it and I of course would love to see a Legacy Day Lizzie, but I don't know if they're gonna do any more Legacy Days with the way the show has been going and they're kind of like getting away from uh, the legacy book and everything like that like they got rid of it and Remaking your own story, so I don't know if they're gonna make any more legacy day dolls um, But my top one that I would love them to make a Lizzie for is Dragon games I can just see how cool she would look and then she could have a dragon. It's like red 
black and gold and I was thinking it could be called Jabberwocky because that's the like monster thing from uh, Wonderland and it'd be kind of a cool dragon name. Let me know what you guys think below. Next we'll check out Lizzie's outfits. This is the signature Lizzie which is more black and red with gold accents. And I think this is my favorite look she's ever had so far. Um, I love her stockings, you know, the fabric stockings and her little purse and the shoes. I think she just looks so great. Here's Way to Wonderland Lizzie. She has this huge Queen of Hearts collar and then her outfit has some more color mixed in that she usually doesn't wear like the pink and that blue um, are colors that in her normal self she doesn't have but she has real fabric stockings which I think just looks so much nicer. I love the fabric stockings and her dress is like this um, sheath kind of dress, the blue, and then it just has this exaggerated uh, train or skirt. I don't know what you want to call it, but it looks cute on her. Then we have Tricastlon Lizzie with that like visor that also looks like a crown. This cool collar piece. And then her dress is like a shorter sheath kind of dress, which if you actually look at all the dresses next to each other, they're very similar in the style. And then she has that cool uh, uh, croquet, um, is it croquet? I forget what it's called. The croquet mallet with the, the, uh. Flamingo! Flamingo! That's what they're called, yeah. So, and then here's her shoes. Look at them. Really cool. Next, we'll check out the Spring Unsprung Lizzie. And she has red roses in her headband with gold hearts. And then she has this awesome collar piece. And then here's a look at her dress again. Which, it's like a similar sort of style. Length. It's tighter and then you have this like extra looser skirt and then here's a look at her shoes which look so cool and then finally there is book party Lizzie she has a red sparkly headband that has the different suits of cards this awesome gold necklace with book pages and then the dress that is a sleeveless, I don't know, fashion sheath dress, I believe you would call it. And like I said, it's kind of like a sort of a similar style. Like each one of her dolls has this kind of dress. They put like extra things on it, but basically it's the same pattern almost. Um, and But like different fabrics make it unique. And then finally, here's a look at her shoes. Check them out. They're books on the side here. And they're the same red, similar to the spring, yeah, spring on sprung Lizzie. Okay guys, that was my Lizzie doll comparison. I hope you enjoyed seeing every Lizzie side by side. She looks awesome. I love her black and red hair and um, just her overall color scheme and fashion sense. I think she's really beautiful. One thing I do want to see in a future Lizzie is like a full on huge gown like um, the closest thing right now is the way to Wonderland, but other than that, she has like a short dress on. I would like to see her really decked out in like a ball gown, lots of glitter, and just like looking like she became the Queen of Hearts, like her mom. Um, I would like to see that like a coronation kind of day look. So let me know what you guys think of these Lizzie's down below, and um. 
which of the lines that don't have a Lizzie you would most like to see Lizzie made into a doll for. Thank you so much for all the support on all my videos. Please make sure if you enjoyed this video to give it a thumbs up. If you're a new viewer and haven't already, hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys later. Bye!